Django autocomplete light simple usage. I am trying to understand how to use Django autocomplete light for an existing project. This seems like a good autocomplete solution for Django for which I am already using normal model. Choice. Fields. So, let's say that I have a model named my model that has an id and a name. What I'd like to know is the simplest possible way of creating a form widget that would provide me the same functionality with. So I'd be able to add that widget to any form I wanted in order to select instances of my model without using select.t. What are the required steps to have that? I've already added autocomplete underscore light to installed underscore apps and to else.py and before. However, I am getting confused with what to do next frown. Please don't point me in the documentation I've already read it thoroughly. Select widget is default for model. Choice. Field. This form field does not specify a widget, so the select widget should be used by default with. This is why you see a select field instead of an autocomplete. Did you read Django docs about using widgets? Use autocomplete underscore light dot choice widget instead. All you have to do is specify the widget. If you don't know what is the name of the autocomplete, log in as staff and open http column slash slash your site slash autocomplete slash. Ensure that you have jQuery properly loaded and that autocomplete light static files are loaded too. Alternatives? FTR, another way is possible, using autocomplete underscore light dot model form underscore factory, using shortcuts like autocomplete underscore light dot model form underscore factory or autocomplete underscore light dot get underscore widgets underscore dict. API docs are passable but it does not beat reading the source code. All in all, I think the easiest for you is using the get underscore widgets underscore dict shortcut if you are using a model. Form Hidden docs You might not have found the cookbook because it is a work in progress in the docs underscore rewrite branch. But the second part of High Level Basics provides several examples of using the widget. I know that the docs have a problem, hence the docs underscore rewrite branch. Right now I'm focusing on improving mobile support. If you want to smurf, please consider subscribing.